Sneaky snake has given shoppers a fright at a supermarket in Sydney. The diamond python was spotted slithering along the spice rack at a Woolworths store. That'd stop you, wouldn't it? A shopper who happened to be a former snake catcher saw the three metre reptile and alerted the store manager before setting it free. And hero snake wrangler. <laughs> Elena Alati joins us now from uh, from Woolies. I'll speak. spit it out. Uh, Elena, um, talk us through the moment you spotted the python. Well, I was just browsing the spices, deciding what to put on my chicken that night. <laughs> and I hadn't seen him initially. <laughs> he was kind of hidden behind the snake, behind the spices. Um, and he just decided to poke his head out and say hello. You, no. His face was probably about 20 centimetres from mine when I turned to the right. Hang on, hang <laughs> no on, one else no. was in the aisle. No, you're, you're way too calm. What really happened? <laughs> What really happened? <laughs> I promise that's what happened. I wish someone else was in the aisle so they could see how cool I reacted. Oh, well done. <laughs> but they weren't. So what, did you, what you. did you do? Exactly what did you do? Well, I mean, the first, I had a little giggle to myself because I couldn't really believe it was happening. Um, and then I took that video that's been kind of going all over the internet <laughs> and then thought I better, I thought I better tell a staff member they had a 10 foot python in their spice aisle. Right. <laughs> And, and did they come on the loudspeaker and go, Python Isle 5, Python Isle 5? <laughs> no, it wasn't quite that dramatic. We just cordoned off the, cordoned off the aisle and I ran home to grab my steak bag and came back. Um, what are the chances that the snake comes out to see the former snake catcher? Yeah, I, um, I, I think, I do believe snakes or animals in general have a little bit of a sixth sense about people and you know, it would have been there from at least that night before, so a few hours, and dozens of people would have passed it and grabbed spices and whatever they wanted, and it just happened to poke its head out to me. So, And you can see it's in the video, it's in a really straight position. When snakes are defensive or worried, they get in that S-shaped position as if they're ready, so they can be ready to strike if they need to. It was just <sighs> curious, just saying hello, super non-aggressive and mellow. Okay. So you're an expert in this, that's why you're not phased and you took the photo, you wrangled it. Um, snake expert, tell us why it was in the spices. Do they have an attraction to <laughs> paprika or, or chilli flakes or something like that? <laughs> no, not that I know of. Um, I think it's come down from the ceiling and kind of dropped into the rack is my is my theory, but no one really knows exactly how it got there. Right. Oh, gee. L look, Elena, lucky it was you, because anyone else would have screamed the shop down. Yeah. Uh, good job. Um, did you Thank get you. <laughs> Did you get your spices for free? <laughs> I did get a bouquet of flowers and a box oh. of chocolate, so that was very oh, nice. The nice. Woolies staff okay. were really excellent. Yeah. <laughs> That's Woolies PR on the job. <laughs> Great you. to meet you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. Ooh, that fun. It's a good story, yeah. isn't it?